did make much because I had some yogurt and grapes this morning. I'm cleaning my axe for some breakfast, so I made him some sausage, eggs, and biscuits. I didn't want any bread, so I opted out of the biscuits, even though they were tempting, very tempting. So I just got a little three little sausage links, turkey sausage, and some eggs, which doesn't have any cheese because we don't have any. I actually ordered some today. It ain't gonna be here till later through uh, Amazon Fresh. So I'm about to do a thing today. I'm about to dye my hair. You know, I'm about to dye my tips. I like to put my hair up in this pineapple when I go to bed. Yeah, I'm about to dye my tips red. I thought I brought the dye in here. This is the dye that I'm gonna use. If y'all ever seen me with some red hair, like recently, not back in the day, this is the color that I used. I got it off of Amazon. I'm also gonna retwist my hair. All right, let me finish eating this. Let me go dye my hair. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do the coach unboxing. Remember I told y'all that I had bought a, a coach denim bag and I bought a card case. So I'm gonna just do the unboxing right here on the vlog. I was gonna do it separately, but girl, I just rather do it right here on the vlog because I can come on here how I wanna come on here and I feel more, I don't know, when you do like a separate sit down video or whatever it may be, it seems like you gotta come on here put together. Like right now, I'm looking a mess. I don't always want to come on in front of the camera put together because it's just not realistic. I just want to come on here, sit down, like on FaceTime with my friends because when I'm on FaceTime with whoever I'm FaceTime and I'm not always put together. And that's another reason why I don't do a lot of separate content related videos. I'm just more comfortable vlogging, if that makes sense. I know I did order the denim tabby in the size 26. They shipped it yesterday but it's still sitting they ain't picked it up yet or ups ain't picked it up yet so that would be here next week sometime and i'm gonna show you all that i don't know if i'm gonna keep it i don't even know if i'm gonna keep the heart back we gonna see play around with it i don't want to keep both i don't need to keep both but i do want more of the tabbies i do want more of those so i might sell a couple more bags around here i know this might come to a surprise but i might sell some mcm bags because it's a couple of them sitting on my shelf that I don't reach for. It's like a couple of them sitting on my shelf that I haven't reached for in like over a year. I know y'all tired of this fork and this food flinging. So I might put a couple bags on the website because I want to get in the habit of if I want a bag, I need to sell a bag or if I want a bag, sell two bags or something like that. I just don't want to keep accumulating bags. I'm at uh, we at Disney Springs, so I'm with my ride or die. But yeah, we're at Disney Springs. I'm about to go find something to eat. Today is Sunday, so mm, it's probably gonna be super crowded. And reservations gonna be probably 45 minutes to an hour. We'll see. We gotta go down again, because remember we parked on level four. Yeah. We're about to go find something to eat and see what else we're about to get into. Like I said, it's real gloomy and raining. Naya went to hang with her friends earlier. She left like 11 o'clock this morning. So Naya's on her way out, y'all. She thinks she grown. She about to go hang with her friends. Okay. <laughs> so what y'all gonna do? Walk around the stores. You got money? Yeah. Hi guys, it's Naya here taking over the vlog. And we're in Mo's right now. We're just sitting here. I'm in a plaza with my friend Jason. Huh? Hey. And <laughs> Okay, but anyway, so wait, why does my teeth look like okay? Because we're in Mo's right now and it's like bad lighting. But we uh, just came from Dollar Tree. So I got Mike and <laughs> So I got Mike and Ike's. Um and some vitamin water. What'd you get? I got two bags of Reese's. Her. Yeah. Okay. We're going to Michael's to see the Hello Kitty kids. <laughs> yeah, we're going to Michael's to see the Hello Kitty kids. Her. Yeah. 
yeah. So, we'll see you guys soon. We're Michaels. And we're probably just gonna look around. <gasps> they have Hello Kitty. Let's go. This is actually cute help. Look. You can like paint it. This is all cute. The Hello Kitty and Friends. Uh, That's why I went when I seen the um the Hello Kitty cafe thingy. Icing decorations. Look, and they got all this. The I, um, oh, no, I have stickers. that. Do I have the little stickers? Look, see, this is the baking set I was talking about. Oh, wait, about. that's actually kind of cute, help. They got a kitchen set. Wait, I want to see if they have this one. Do I don't know which one? one it is. Wait, you have to look at the number. This one says Barbie. I don't think they have any more. Okay, so we found this Too Faced. No, this is the, um, this is the concealer I use. But it's um lip oil or something. I don't know. Yeah. And we go over here. I found a Hello Kitty sleeping mask, but this is ugly. Like, why is it blue? Right. Ew. I don't know, Hello but Kitty. it's not Hello Kitty. We need Hello Kitty, though. Oh my gosh. I don't think they have anything in here. Really. We really don't have anything in here that I would want. Let's see, guys. <laughs> How many things do you have? Oprah, I have this. I just bought this the last time I came here. <gasps> Look, this is a cute, um, like set, like the little glass thing. That's cute, and they have these too. But we have oh, these are just normal. <gasps> Look, oh, yeah, but it's how much is that? Like 17 or something? Um, 60 yeah. or 17 dollars, yeah. And then I have these cute love wave brushes. These are cute, but I prefer the black ones because the other ones get too dirty. Yeah. They also have another. Look, they have the mini one right here. The one that I have. Oh, how much is this? I want to see if it's cheaper. Yeah, that's the one. I yeah, I want to see if this is cheaper because I have this one, but mine is cracked. 60. Oh, yeah. No, it's the same price as Amazon because it's 60 on Amazon too. So, no discount. Okay, let me see if they have any cute earrings. Don't like that. What the? These are all ugly to me. The Disney. Mm. No, it's ugly. Hey, guys. This one is cute, though. I like this one better because they do have the, the Hello Kitty one that I already have, but I like this one better. This one is more pink and pretty. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What is this? This is a travel bag. This is actually so cute. It's not my style though. It looks too like baby to me. It looks like a cute duffel bag though. It looks like there's a lot of space in it. Yeah, look, that's the new uh what that cyber truck. Hold on, baby. Let me call Cleveland real quick. <laughs> this mug is hideous. Y'all, I'm gonna get enough of wearing these doggone slides when it's raining or when it's wet. But I didn't know it was raining. They just so comfortable to slip on cause they be like right by the door and I just slip them on. Y'all know how y'all got that one pair of shoes that y'all just slip on when you're going to run errands or something. But it's just drizzling a little bit. Not too bad. It is thundering and lightning though. <laughs> Have anybody ever ate here? Huh? Oh, did she like it? Yeah, that's what a lot of people say. Yeah, a lot of people say it costs too much and the steak is not that good for how much they charge. Me, I walk down some stairs. Asia. All right, so we decided to sit at the bar because it's a 50 minute wait. So, I'm out of time, she's out the door, I gotta go for mine. Or should I talk about a smile? Oh, what about a smile? I'm out of time, she's out the door, I gotta go for mine. Cause I don't see you. Excuse me, Miss Bowman. So good, I should have got that. I 
donuts, and macaroni and cheese. <laughs> this looks nasty. That's all I can do. They be putting way too much cheese. I think I'm gonna stop getting the macaroni and cheese from here because this is just like ridiculous. Like the top cheese is like five inches thick. No reason. Deja <laughs> covered all her stuff up, but them um, but them donuts was delicious. Eyebrows. She suggested a couple products, which is the Anastasia, Anastasia uh, eyebrow pencil, and some kind of highlighter she was using. Yeah, y'all been on Anastasia. Oh, really? Well, at least I yeah, used to buy it. their um, their brow gel pencil. Mm -hmm. We're about to get some ice cream real quick, but I think I'm going to just stick with a classic flavor. I got like pot of gold and rainbows, this cereal milk, I don't know. I'm sick to my stomach. Though. Peanut butter. Peanut butter brownie cereal puffs probably tastes like, um, what is it? Reese's oh, like, like, yeah, Reese Puffs. I want to try the um, pot of gold. Um, I got, I got what, what, what you get? The brownie? Oh, great. I need a backup. Can I try the pot of gold? Yeah, just a single scoop and a cone. Mm -hmm. Um, which one's smaller? Waffle yeah. corn. Okay, the sugar. Is that brownie? So what is that one? Uh, thank you. No, that's it. Lucky Charms was one of my favorite cereals growing up, but I've never drunk the milk. Like, I hate the milk. I just pour it out, so I was kind of hesitant. But once I taste it, very good. This is really good. And it's not that sweet, so that's a plus for me. It's good. Alright, so I'm back home. Let me do this coach unboxing real quick. Um, I did go on a coach tour today at Disney Springs. I was so tempted to buy another bag, but I didn't. And she did that with the eyebrows, didn't she? She really did do that. She was so sweet. Her name is Kay. And she's in the Sephora at Disney Springs. I'm definitely gonna go back to her when I wanna get my eyebrows waxed. like two days later from when I came on here saying I was about to show y'all or do the unboxing on the coach bag yeah my mama had called that night and then that next day I didn't pick y'all up until dinner and then that's what y'all just seen me making some good old beef stew girl ain't even none left <laughs> they tore it up Deja ate the last of it before she went to work this morning I was thinking that pot was gonna last a cool three days maybe two but it only lasts a day and a half. Look, I don't plan on cooking again. We leave in a couple days. If y'all don't know, we're going on another cruise. Naya's spring break starts 
Thursday. Yeah, her last day is Thursday. We leave Friday for LA. We are hopping on a flight from here to LAX, Los Angeles. Another early flight, 6.30 in the morning. So be ready, get your stuff packed. I'm letting y'all know what, three days ahead. But some of y'all already stay ready. We doing um a California coast cruise, which I'm excited for because that's totally different from what we used to, what we're used to cruising. Never cruised out of Los Angeles before and never got on a princess ship. This is the new, I don't think it's the newest ship. Yes, it is, which is the Diamond Princess, if I'm not mistaken. So I did get a mini suite so all of us could fit. Well, we can fit in the other rooms because obviously y'all was with us, right? But it would be more space for us all. You know, the last cruise, we had an inside cabin, but that's okay. We all fit. Y'all all came along and we made it work. <laughs> I got a really good deal on it because they was running some kind of sale. Let me take this scarf off. I had this scarf on all day yesterday, all day today. Oh, no, I took it off this morning because I did call myself trying to do like a little style in the front. I like to wear my hair in a ponytail like this. So... Obviously, you see I retwisted my hair. So I call myself doing like a little, you know, a little style in the front. Y'all see? So I want to make this higher. I don't know if I told y'all, but the one regret, the one regret, is it a regret? Yeah, it's a regret. I wish I would have, I wouldn't have got them so long. Y'all remember I got these a year ago, right? And when I ordered my locks, I had a teeny weeny fro. And so the 10 inch, that's what inch these are, would have been good. You know what I'm saying? But my hair has grown a lot in a year um, to make it fuller up here. Cause I don't know, it, it seemed a little, dang, if I take these, well, I could still, I don't know. I gotta play around with it, but I'm gonna leave the front as is. It really doesn't look like I did nothing to the front, but I did. I left one down on the side here. And then I took this row and kind of crisscrossed it and twisted it. The next row, which is just one row, I kind of twisted it. And then this one is, two rows I crisscross it and then that's two rows crisscrossed one row twisted and crisscross you really can't tell it's not really detailed but y'all see what I was going for so I'm gonna put this scarf on and then I'm gonna put my bonnet on on top of it and on top of this okay let's get to the um card holder and the coach bag I already unboxed it already because I just couldn't wait I was just ready to see what it looked like, see what it was giving. My other one, which is the tabby, the quilted tabby in the denim, uh, 26, size 26 won't be here until tomorrow. So I'm gonna unbox that and I'm gonna decide which one I wanna keep. Look at it. It's so cute. I love it, but I just don't think I'm gonna keep it. I cannot keep both. I, I'm not doing that to myself. I am not. That's what the inside looks like. So here's the card holder right here. You know, it's just a typical card holder, holds four cards, two in the front, two in the back, and then it got this like middle thing, which I never use. I never put anything in here. This fits in here. My dilemma with small bags is um, not being able to fit my camera in it. So I grabbed Naya's camera, which is the same size of the camera that I'm recording with and it fits it does i got the card holder in here and then my phone which is the plus oh i bought some new cases as well they'll be here tomorrow i think i know they'll be here before we leave but i bought a denim case <laughs> i bought a denim phone case yeah i bought a denim phone case and look my phone this <laughs> is it don't work for me and it's only because of this camera, but I got to have my camera. And I could leave out my phone and put my camera in here. My keys are fit in here. My keys are always downstairs because I got a, a key hook. So they're, they're downstairs on the key hook thingy by the door. I gotta have my hand sanitizer, um, some lip balm, and I'm, really mu I'm pretty much good to go. So this will close up and it's good it'll close up with no problems but girl i gotta have my camera you know i gotta work but i don't want to be paying this much for a bag that i can't 
use it the way I want to use it because I'm not the type of person that always have my phone in my hand because you know some people be like well I don't need to put my phone in my purse I always have it in my hand anyway I don't I do vlog with my phone but not all the time and when I'm not vlogging with my phone this show not in my hand this is not fitting with all of this stuff so it, it just has to go back thought that I'd be healing now I didn't think I'd have to feel this now I thought I would have moved on But somehow the feeling's still strong Like I'll be on my way out Thinking that I'm good right Suddenly you pass by Now you're stuck on my mind Thinking I was done now But I guess I'll never be tired That was a good workout. That was good. It was only about 20 minutes, but hey... It's enough to get get it, get your day started. I've been up since four, but I struggled to lift those covers back and touch the floor. I laid in bed for about an hour. Finally decided to get up. I, I pushed myself to get up. Because y'all, I, I tell y'all all the time that I have no problem like waking up early. It's getting up out of the bed. Like I can lay there for hours and getting up, getting ready. Like when we have an early flight, that means I have to get ready, get ready. I hate it and I'm about to encounter that in two days but that means I got to get up at like 3 3 30 yay it's, I'm trying to create healthy habits or better habits just better habits in general getting up in the morning doing some type of workout is one of them so let's hope I keep up with it but anyway how's your day man girl I hope it's I hope it got off to a good start and if it hasn't I hope it gets better as the day progresses. I'm watching the news, that poor baby. It was a little girl who got killed here, Maddie Soto. Uh, her mother's boyfriend killed her. And it's always the mother's boyfriend. Y'all better be careful out here with these dudes around your kids. Like, do you know that some of these men date you or marry you just to get close to your kids, just to do unspeakable things to your kids they don't care nothing about you they trying to get to your kids it's sickening sickening he probably was doing unspeakable things to her before he even killed her like who knows how long that's been going on and if you are someone who went through any kind of traumatizing experience like that i can't really say the words here on youtube but y'all know what i'm talking about my heart goes out to you i am so sorry your family or your parents failed you because with most of these kids the people that's the adults around them fail them and like i said my heart goes out to you i hope you in some kind of therapy or counseling but i can't recommend nobody else but jesus he he will get you through now it's not gonna happen overnight just turn to jesus to help you through it and if you are someone who's currently going through it, go tell someone. Tell a teacher. Tell a friend. I wish I can give y'all a big old hug. Oh, I can. I can give you, come on, come here. A little virtual hug. It's not your fault. said that because first of all I was really shocked that he even said that because what I don't I have a choice he said you have no choice I said I have no choice like my voice like everything changed I said oh, okay so this is how this gonna go like I came off nice at first but no I was like oh okay so he was he we was just dead staring at each other for a minute <laughs> this your manager <laughs> we were just staring at each other for a grit because what are you talking about right now and I was like, yeah. So I was like, I have no choice. He was like, 
no, not really. I said, how don't I have a choice? <laughs> like, I needed to know more. Because what are you talking about? Because I said, the more I read, the more I figured out what it was, I don't want to be doing all that. <laughs> like, huh? I'm going to just tell you how it is. And the thing is, I would do all this if I'm getting paid more. They don't be paying mm -hmm. people more for nothing. Yeah. They be giving you extra work and extra different special tasks, mm -hmm. but no more money. Like, right. huh? Give me more money. Sure, I'll hop on board. <laughs> like, am I getting paid more? Like, what are you talking about? I said, I don't want to be- Right, he tried to make it all right. like a special right. team. Oh, yeah. Can I get special money? A right. special pay? Am I getting more money? Like, I don't care about what? That. A raise? The thing is, before all this, he said, you're going to get a new badge. I don't give a crap about no badge. I want <laughs> money. This nigga came with a badge? A new he said, badge. Get a new badge. Like, what? I, I want money. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> like, what? You came out straight to me. I said, I feel like if it wasn't special, you wouldn't have single-handedly came out to me. Mm -hmm. He kept saying, this is a part of your job. This is what you, you're here for. I said, no, it's not. This is something special on the side. I don't got to do this. That's why he came to you and exactly. said it was special. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. And then he was like, he was like, after all that, he was like, yeah, I don't want you to feel pressured. He's like, I don't want you to feel pressured that like you have to do this, but you just said I had no choice. And he was like, I just wanted to give you an opportunity. If you're giving me an opportunity, that's something I can decline or a set. That's why it's an opportunity. Mm -hmm. So what are you talking about? How is this not something special? It right. is something special. It's a special opportunity for me. That's why people regret not taking an opportunity because you have a choice. So I do have a choice because right. it's not because it's something special. Like I what? Mean, he went down back on he his wasn't work. expecting. Right. I was literally <laughs> eating him up, and like he was getting destroyed because everything he said made no sense. Like what? It literally made no sense. So that's good because you spoke up for everybody, everybody in the thing. Everybody cause be getting destroyed and just and they just let them. Yeah. yeah. They be, they're all the girls. They be like, I'd be scared. I'd be like, what, girl? You don't say something. <laughs> to be stressing and doing crap I don't want to do so I'm gonna say something number one so like what uh -huh. so yeah when he was like swallowing when I told him no and all that junk when he was swallowing and getting nervous I said are you okay <laughs> you're saying that yes because <laughs> I needed to know it was crazy he looked distraught it's like he never had rejection or something I was like are you okay I literally had to ask him like it because his face and even the girls that was sitting on Toration, mm. once I got done talking, she brought it up to me. She was like, the way you had him, I was so bad. But his face. Somebody needed to do it. Oh, yeah, because nobody <laughs> be saying nothing. And he was like some, oh, oh, yeah, I'm fine. I just want to let you know there's no animosity. Nobody was even thinking that. I'm talking about how crazy you look right now. Like him swallowing. I literally was watching every expression. And I pay a close attention to detail to people's face. So I was like, whoa. Like, I'm so shocked. I said, okay, because, like, is it eager you need people or something? Because, the, like, the reaction, I'm like, is this dire? Like, cause why are you getting so crazy for me saying no? Like, I don't understand. <laughs> He's like, there's no animosity. I said, oh, yeah, I know that. I'm like, what? <laughs> Duh. Why would there be animosity? The fact he even thought to even say that, there is animosity. Because nobody was even talking about that. What? Mm -hmm. There he is. And, ugh, anyways. But, yeah, ultimately... He, yeah, he was like, I don't want to force you to do anything. I said, okay, yeah, because I don't want to do it. I was like, yeah, when I was like, do you need more people? He was like, oh, no, I can find somebody else. Oh, yeah, you sure can, so go ahead. I'm not doing this job. <laughs> he obviously can't find nobody else. Right. Well, if, no. well, he might if you said ain't nobody speaking up. Ultimately, I was like, yeah, I was just letting you know so I don't waste your time, so I don't be into it and I waste your time. He's like, yeah, okay. Thanks for letting me know. I just walked off. Mm -mm -mm. And he thought he had one. Right. He thought he, he should have already knew that. He should have already knew that. He already know how I am. Cause I, uh, you know, he should have already knew that junk. Like what? Cause from the first time they tried that junk, I went straight to the back. I said, I'm not doing that. Take me off. Where's Where's he? <laughs> he literally put me on something without telling me at all. Mm -hmm. And then he he was gone. He went on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all heard Deja and her shenanigans at work. Hold on, my fish. I'm frying, ooh, this lighting. I'm frying some fish in this uh, deep fryer. Don't judge me, I need to change the grease. <laughs> but it's still, wait a minute, why does it seem like it's not on? This fish about to be a greasy mess. This, like, what happened? So it's just sitting in the grease, y'all. Ain't this a mess? We'll see how that turns out. 
Um, we're about to go pick Naya up from school in a, about 30 minutes. And then we're going to go get our nails done. I actually need to text her and tell her we're going to get our nails done. She texts Cleveland earlier, asked him to go to Publix to get some sushi, like the California rolls, because on Wednesdays it's $5. I didn't want to eat out, so I'm frying some fish and I got some okra on. I haven't had any okra in so long. Y'all, I used to love okra, especially fried okra. But I haven't had it in a minute, and I had a bag in there, so I just popped that on the stove. I didn't even do my eyebrows. So this whole look, which I'm loving my hair. Y'all know I love pineapple style. That was one of my go-to styles with my first install, either pineapple or two buns. And I'm just loving this style. This one just doing what it wants to do. That's how locks works. Just do it, just does what they want to do. But I did order some shells, some sea shells. Yeah, I know I used to wear them with my first install. So I ordered some from Amazon, and I know I'm gonna put one on this lock so I can keep it down. That's what I used to do to my um, other locks, the ones that was all sticking straight up. It's probably about the storm. So I know what happened. By me, hold on, let me show y'all. By me constantly shaking, and it wasn't odd, the plug wasn't all the way secure in the back. It just popped on out. I shook it on out. The fish turned out really good. It's not greasy at all. Um, I must have caught it in time or checked on it in time so it wasn't just sitting in the grease for that long. I'm about to drizzle on some Mike's hot honey. You see my okra sitting over there. This plate look kind of homely. This is gonna do for right now. It's only 2.30. Gonna grab an Olipop. This is the strawberry vanilla. I'm watching this couple on YouTube called On The Go. Hold on. Parker's On The Go. And they just boarded uh, MSC's Seaside. That's what shit we got on, right? Yeah. The newest one is Seascape. Yeah, we got on the seaside. They was doing them dirty. It's basically, they whole experience on that ship sucked. We didn't have the best experience, but we didn't encounter like waiters ignoring us. <laughs> so yeah, I'm about to eat this real quick. I only got about dying. I only got about ten minutes. Did y'all hear Deja and her shenanigans? Her work shenanigans. I don't know why that manager tried her. Because they just not to be tried. I need to pull up a picture for them. For my nails. I'm not getting my toes done because they still good. And Naya's toes are still good as well. Ooh, hot. And I'm trying to think if I just want them square. Or if I want them uh, almond shape. I guess y'all can get y'all nails done too. Also irritating. Let's get into these items. I think these are two um, jewelry pieces that I got from DH Gate. So this is an LV bracelet. So cute. Oh, look at my nails. Hold on. Let's get into the nails first. I showed y'all Naya's nails. Because I knew y'all wouldn't go see her no more. I just got white, short, square, with a little cow print. You know, I wanted some black and white, so just a little something. Let's look at the next one. It, this looks nice. This mug is heavy. This is some LV, or it's a LV bag charm. I'm about to put this on the LV bag that I have been wearing for probably a week now. My black on black LV, um, I think it's a trunk bag. I love the trunk bags. I got three of them. Ooh, and I see they coming out with a new one. I'm like, ooh. I was like, ooh, I hope the private seller that I purchased my uh, replica bags from get that in. Oh, look at the um, packaging that came in. Y'all see that? So pretty. This might be too big. I mean, the bag might be too small. You know what I'm saying? It don't, mm, it don't really look right on this bag. I don't even know where I can put it like right here, but then it, no, nah, that don't look right. Let's put it on the zipper. Mm. 
Uh-uh. Nah. Because this already... Nah, it's just not going to work on this bag. Very good quality. And I think this was like... I don't know. I'll put the price up on the screen because I cannot remember. I ordered this stuff like a month ago. Like I told y'all a couple days ago, I am going to return that heart bag. I just don't need two bags or two of the same bag, basically. So, seems on somebody's community tab stating that the bag was sold out everywhere. The heart bag was sold out everywhere as well. So, I was like instead of me returning it maybe i can see if one of you guys wanted to purchase it i'll just put it on the website and if nobody buys it then i'll just take it back to the store um yeah if nobody purchased it um i'll just take it back to the store but i did want to offer it to you guys just in case you wanted to get your hands on it and couldn't and i've seen this other girl purchase the quilted tabby at denim the size 26 and the 20 because um, she couldn't decide which size that she wanted oh my god six minutes left on here on the memory card she couldn't decide which uh size that she wanted so she went with the 26 and was going to put uh her 20 up on poshmark and she was going to sell it, you know, for more than what she paid for. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm just going to sell it for what I paid for, including the tax, which was, I can't even remember. I ain't going to do y'all like that. Be trying to mark it up. I think she said she was going to try to sell it for $600. I seen a couple of them bags going for a thousand on Poshmark. I said, <laughs> I know y'all lying, but coach has such good packaging and i already know i'm gonna love her oh she's so pretty okay so here she is she's so pretty so i'm pretty sure a lot of y'all know how the tabbies are set up but if you don't it has a magnetic pocket right here that I can put my phone in comfortably because the size 20 will not fit my phone well the phone where's my phone the phone I mean my phone can go in it but it won't the tab won't close so it'll be looking like this so let's put the phone in there and Put the phone in there. Boom. The phone is tucked away. And then I can also put it back here as well. Oh, I didn't know this was magnetic too. This little part right here is magnetic. <laughs> Love to see it. Um, yeah, and then we have three compartments in here. We got this back compartment. I'm taking all of this out because, I mean, I already know I'm keeping this bag. We got a zippered compartment here in the middle. And then we got another compartment here. Camera. Card holder, which matches oh so perfectly. I mean, duh, it's the same <laughs> collection. So I can just slip that down in there. And then, where is my hand sanitizer? I'm so confused. My hand sanitizer, oh, here we go. And then we got my hand sanitizer. And then I'm gonna just say, these are my keys, cause my keys is not, I don't have no big old bulky keys anyway. So my keys, and I still got a lot of space in there. I haven't even put any, I haven't even put anything in the middle, but of course, everybody's not gonna have a camera. So I'm gonna take this camera out and <laughs> look. That's basically all that I carry. I honestly kind of wish this was magnetic because it's like you gotta like fumble around to fit this little piece here in the hole. So you see what I'm saying? Like if I'm not looking, I have to fumble around with it. Like I have to actually look and kind of line up. Hmm. I'm gonna have to get used to that, I guess. I don't know, it's like it's... Oh, I know why. Cause it's like, it's pulling. You see, 
this um, chain here, it's like it's not, I don't know, it's giving resistance because I got it crossbody. I don't know, y'all, but I, I kind of don't like that. You see how the chain is giving it, like pulling it back. And I got to kind of fix it in order to line it up. Hmm, I don't know y'all, that might be a big deal for me to be honest. Like, uh, I don't know, am I being too picky? Cause I, I don't like that. It's like I have to fool around with the, you see? It's like it's not, am I just too big or something? Is it not, the chain is not long enough? That's what it seems like it is, it's like I'm too, like big and the chain is not long enough. So therefore I have to kind of like, you know, hold it up in order for it to fall right. And then still got to fool around with it to line it up. Mm. Yeah, I don't know y'all. Um, that's gonna annoy me and then it's gonna deter me from reaching for the bag. Oh girl, I don't know. And to be honest, I already have a denim bag that I haven't even worn yet. The YSL bag is from DH Gate. Oh no, is it from DH Gate? Yeah, it's from DH Gate, but let me go get that real quick. You know what, this is, maybe that's just the nature of these bags. So I'm guessing I don't like these chain bags like this. So I have to lift the bag up so it won't have that tension. It's kind of hard to explain, <laughs> y'all. I have to lift the bag up a little to get the tension off and then, you know, open it wider. Or else it's like, that's, that's as far as it going. Now, I do have a Tory Burch bag that's like this. Let's see if she's giving the same resistance. So this is a good old Tory Burch bag that I got off of Nordstrom's on sale. So let's pop her on crossbody. And see, this is a comfortable size though, to be honest. This is so much comfortable. It doesn't feel bulky. That YSL bag feels kind of bulky. The coach bag feels kind of bulky on me. And I know by me being a bigger, fluffier girl, the bigger bags look better, I guess, than the smaller ones. But I don't think this one looks bad at all. This is like the perfect size right here. I wonder what size this is. I have no problem with the Tory Burch bag. I don't need to lift it up to open it up all the way. Look. Okay, Tory. And love the magnetic. Look at that. Okay, let me see. We got the camera. We got the card holder. Oh, let me show y'all what the inside looks like. Because I don't even think I showed y'all this bag. But it's just this beautiful brown caramel color. And it's suede, which I need to spray it before I wear it. And then in the inside, it just looks like that. And it's nothing on the back. But this... But the color is so beautiful. Okay, let me put this back in here. Uh, the card holder. My phone will fit right in the little flap that y'all see. Not the flap, but there's a little compartment right there. That fits right in there with no problem. Let me see if y'all see that. It fits right in there. Okay, hand sanitizer and lip balm. bag when I bought it I didn't try it on <laughs> I didn't um, even show y'all the bag I just literally took it out the packaging I knew I wanted to keep it but I just literally took it out the packaging and put it on my shelf I think she's going back y'all she's either going she's either going back or I'm gonna put her on the website because this bag is sold out as well with tax and everything this bag did come up to five hundred and eighty eight dollars and that is all I'm asking for free shipping so I'm gonna put this bag and the heart bag on the website and if it doesn't sell I will be taking it back 
to the coach store. I did take all the packaging and stuff off, but I think I'm good because I didn't pop the tags or anything. Um, I'm gonna try to package it back up as good as, or best as I can. And I'm probably gonna put this bag on the website as well. Again, I never tried it on and like played around with it. I just took the packaging off. I think I did a video on it, a DH gate haul video, and then I just put it on the shelf. So I don't, I might have did try this on. I can't remember. With this bag, I don't like how far the bag comes. It's like past my waist and I like my bags to sit like right at my waist. And it's past my waist and then I was, as I was walking, it's like, you know, it's in the way. You see what I'm saying? Like if it was up here, I can freely move my leg. But down here, it's like I'm, it's something in the way. So that sucks that neither one of the bags worked out. I really wish it woulda, cause they are beautiful bags. I really wish I woulda went into the store. I didn't make it a priority to go to the store. I just ordered both of them online. I don't know, I'm kind of bummed cause I wanted at least something from that collection. Well, I got the card case. I'm not gonna keep them just because they're cute and just have them sitting on the shelf. Yeah, so, hmm. So yeah, y'all let me know y'all thoughts down below. If the bag doesn't sell before or by tomorrow, because I want to take both of the bags back before I leave on vacation. I know I got 30 days, but I wanna make sure <laughs> there's no problems. So I wanna take the back, bag back as soon as possible. So if you go on there and you don't see the bags on the website, that means it's sold. Cause usually when I list anything other than my products and it sells, I just take it off because you know, that's not what my website is for, but I use it because I'm not about to use uh, Poshmark. Poshmark charges. I'm not about to pay Poshmark to list my items when I have my own website. Yeah, if any item sells, I just take the listing down. So if you don't see it, that means they're ha they have been sold. But I thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you comment something down below. Engage. Talk to your girl. Let me know your thoughts. And thumbs up the video. And make sure you turn on your notifications. It notifies you, of course, of or when I post a YouTube video. And it notifies you when I post anything on a community tab. And sometimes I will post if... Um, you know, if I'm selling purses on the community tab, and sometimes I do like a Velvety Vibe secret sale, um, like with a coupon code, or I'll let y'all know when a new product drop or when it's restock or, you know, I do that every now and again over there. But the best way to get like information on Velvety Vibes is to head over to the website and sign up for the email um, subscription thingy. But anyway, I appreciate y'all watching and I will see y'all tomorrow. I'm definitely gonna pick y'all up tomorrow because we're gonna pack, we're gonna go through these clothes. I need to clean out my closet. That's what we're gonna do tomorrow. Clean out this closet. I got so much stuff like on the top shelves, like boxes that I kept like for no reason. And some of the boxes that I have, I no longer even have the product. And I need to go to Target tomorrow. But anyway, thanks for watching, girl. Be blessed. Have a great night, day, evening. I'm going to start giving y'all virtual hugs. I know I gave y'all one earlier, but those were for the girlies that, you know, was going through some things. But this one is for everybody. Bring it in. Bring it on in. Love you. Mm.